Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Hamilton and today we're going to be comparing Rebrandly versus Prime Link. Now these two platforms offer very, very similar services and products, but we're going to decide today which one is better, which one is more efficient and which one is cheaper. So without further ado, let's just jump straight into the video. So starting off with Prime Link here, we can see that these guys offer QR codes, they offer bio pages. So if you have an Instagram, you will basically have multiple links that you want to put on there, but Instagram only let you put one link on there, right? So you would actually have a bio link that links to a page that shows all of your other socials. That's essentially what a bio page is, okay? Then we have link shortening services, and these guys really do excel at this. We want to shorten this link here. Bang, okay, we just press shorten. We've got the link. We can then use that anywhere across all of our social medias, and we can track it with analytics as well. These guys offer a bunch of different features, as you can see here. You can get custom landing pages for your bio pages. You can have CTA overlays, right? So call to action for your leads, for your potential customers, right? You can have event tracking and a lot of other different stuff as well. You've also got the ability to add team members to this so they can manage your links for you. If we do go to the back end here of Prime Link, we can see the dashboard is very, very easy to use. So we have our analytics here. We have our geolocations for people that have used our links and and we have our link shortener right here if we want to add a link or we can do multiple links here where we do basically 10 earls at once it's going to shorten all of them and then you can use those throughout your socials so really cool stuff here from prime link we go to the bio pages section i've set one up here to kind of show you how it works very very simple you've got a demo on the right hand side here of what your bio page will look like and then you've got endless customization options here in this version and this version is actually free as well well, right? So you can add images, emojis, okay, you can add headings, there's lots of different things you can actually add and embed into your bio page for free uh, because they give you one bio page for free uh, on the free version. And this is something a lot of platforms won't give you, they will limit your customization, but Prime Link, they do not limit your customization at all, right? You can book meetings here, you can even have payment gateways on your bio links, and that's something I've not seen a lot of people do here. So fantastic customization there on the bio link side for Prime Link. They also do a bunch of other stuff, including QR codes, including file hosting. So if you had an ebook and you wanted to put that on your bio page, you can do that as well. All right. And they have uh, all of the other stuff that they offer as well, right? So campaign management, you've got CTA overlays, right? You've got management of your links separately here in this section. So definitely, definitely one that is high up on the list for me, if not first, when it comes to link generation, when it comes to branded domains when it comes to bio pages. Now, when it comes to Rebrandly, they do offer a similar service here, guys, but the customization just isn't on the same level as Prime Link. You can see here, yes, we can add links right here, okay? Uh, we can't really add many pictures or anything with those links. There's no way to add stuff in between the links like we saw with Prime Link, right? Uh, and if we wanna change the profile picture on this bio page, then we'll actually have to go into our profile on the Rebrandly site, change our profile and then have that synced up to this bio page. If you're wanting multiple bio pages, stuff like this, then that's going to be very difficult to do on this platform. Whereas on Prime Link, uh, you can actually have multiple bio pages set up, okay, multiple channels with different pictures, customization, and all of the other features we've talked about in this video so far. But with that said and done, they do offer a lot of features here when it comes to integrations, when it comes to using your own domains, and when it comes to management with your team as well. Well, okay, so not terrible, but I do think Prime Link does win on the product overall. Okay, we are looking at this. They do offer the link shortening as well. And after pressing it and completing the capture, we can actually see here that uh, it has generated us a link. It's not a very nice looking link, I will say. Okay, rb.gy. I mean, just numbers here for our shortened link, but it is a link to say the least. So they do do what they're saying they want to do. Uh, and that's something that is a positive, I would say. Okay, if we are going to go over to pricing here, let's just compare these two platforms. So if we go to Rebrandly's pricing here, we can see that uh, it's it's pretty expensive when it comes to the higher tiers here. All right, uh, this is something we don't see with Prime Link. Okay, we'll talk about the features in a minute, but with Prime Link, we can see here that uh, yes, it is 50 bucks a month. That's fine. All right, if we go over to Enterprise or Premium on Brandly, it's in the hundreds of dollars. This is crazy to me. 
um, because they're not actually offering that good of a service when you're looking at all the customization that you can get with Prime Link. Okay, the other thing with Prime Link when it does come to pricing is they do actually have a lifetime option, right? So what you're going to do here is actually buy the lifetime option and then from that point you never have to pay again. No subscription that you're going to forget about, no recurring costs. You have this for life for your business or for your businesses and this is something that I've not seen a lot of these platforms do, okay? And this just kind of shows the integrity that these guys are putting out there. So if we do talk about what you actually get here, uh, they're going to say, hey, uh, for eight bucks a month here on Rebrandly, you're going to get an AI boost, okay? You're going to get 404 redirection, okay? And you're going to get password protection for your link. So if you have a link that you only want to be sent to people that have paid you, right, then you can give those people a password and then have that link protected before they can access the page. This is a positive and this is something that is different to Prime Link. But besides that, guys, I mean, you're not really getting that much else here in terms of a product when it comes to Rebrandly. I will say as well, Prime Link do offer ridiculous amounts of links, even on the free version, okay, you're getting 50 links, okay, you're getting a thousand clicks per month and you're getting that data retention monthly uh, for 30 days, which is good, okay? You get one bio page on the free version, but if we do go over to the paid version and we go to the monthly, yes, it's $9, but you're getting so many more features as well. Some of these features include uh, actually having your links visible on your bio pages for scheduled amounts of time, right? So if you have a campaign that you're putting out there or you've signed a deal with your sponsor, you can schedule that link to be up for that specified amount of time for your users and that is something that is massive and something that not a lot of people do out here and that is something that is really different here so uh, that's just one of the features these guys have they also have CTA overlays as we talked about at the beginning they also have the ability to actually use team members to manage your links so on the lowest package here you can see you would have five team members to manage your links that's something that I use for my business a lot okay and if you do go to these higher packages and you get 20 and then you can get unlimited here for this enterprise package but I will advise you guys if you do want the enterprise one I would definitely just get the lifetime version instead it's going to save you a lot of money and it's just going to get you to where you want to be with pretty much all access to the platform forever right uh, that's something that's massive and what we will say as well here guys uh, one thing I do like about Prime Link that really just sets it apart from Rebrandly in total is they do allow you to have geography involved here what that means is you could have a certain language showing up on your bio page uh, with certain links in different languages uh, depending on the country that is viewing your bio page right it sounds very simple but if you want to sell a product to people in India then you might want it in that language or on the other hand if you wanted to sell products in the US then you might want it in English right so uh, definitely a lot more customization here on the prime link side and that is why in summary guys when it comes to efficiency I like prime link more for the customization okay when it comes to price I like Prime Link because one, it's far cheaper, they offer way more products, and uh, they offer this lifetime ability. So I will say in this case, Prime Link is the absolute winner when it comes to Rebrandly versus Prime Link. A link will be in the description for Prime Link if you are interested. But besides that, that is where I'm going to leave you today. I will see you in the next video. Cheers.